Now we turn to the latest on the investigation into that scary ride and malfunction that happened at the Norwalk Oyster Festival over the weekend. That's right. 18 people were hurt when riders crashed into one another after a rotating ride suddenly stopped and came down. News 8's Ken Pierce is live in Norwalk to tell us the latest on the police investigation. Kent. Good morning, Allie and Chris. It was about 2.15 yesterday afternoon, and the Norwalk Oyster Fest was in full swing, and so was the Zoomer ride. It's a swing kind of ride. The center of it rotates, and then at the end of long chains are swings, and that's where you put the kids, and they spin around. Well, all of a sudden, at about 2.15 yesterday afternoon, the spinning stopped, and those kids got an unexpected lesson in physics because their momentum kept them going, banging into each other, banging into anything that was within reach of those chains. Now, now, they shut down all the rides immediately. There were 18 people who were hurt. 13 of them hurt badly enough to be taken to local hospitals, one adult and a dozen kids. They inspected everything before and then after the accident, too. And people are wondering how something like this could happen. It's a little disconcerting. You see these uh, types of amusement parks that pop up every now and again. You wonder about the safety. Um, so it's inevitable for these things to happen. I looked to my left and I saw the swing ride, it collapsed. All these people were there. I actually saw someone fall out of the cart. Injured kids everywhere. The parents ripping out the, the gate just trying to get to their kids. I mean, it was just, it was horrible. Now, the state police came in and inspected all the other rides and allowed them to reopen after about two hours. That one ride, the Zoomer, though, that stayed closed and will be investigated. The state police and the local Norwalk fire marshal will be heading up that investigation. No word on what caused the ride to suddenly shut down as of yet. Oyster Festival has also shut down, and all those rides have been packed up and are now out of here. We're live at the site of the Oyster Festival in Norwalk. I'm Ken.